for the best coverage that puts you ahead of the game. Good morning, Make guys. Right how long? How far away is it? I mean, how long? Like, what time? Oh, okay. Bill, do you see that? Good morning, you guys. I'm going to try to vlog today. Happy. We'll turn it down for a second. Please. Happy. What day we on? Thursday? Happy Thursday, guys. November the 1st, guys. Can you believe we is in November already? Ciao. It's raining today, y'all. It's a rainy, cloudy day. But it's still a beautiful day in Zamunda. <laughs> so I haven't vlogged in a while, so I figured I'd do a vlog style video today. Which means you all will see different clips. So right now I'm in the car. You wanna say good morning? Good morning, Nichols. So um yeah. It's um 8:35 a.m. in the a.m. And we out here. I like the rain. I really do. I like when it's rain. I got my rain boots on, y'all. I bought these rain boots months ago. Matter of fact, when did I buy these rain boots? Oh, it was months ago, but I didn't get a chance to wear them because um, it was summertime and you know, the boots come up to my knees, but they're rain boots. And uh, we've been getting like, it's been raining for like the past four days or so. It's been raining for like the past four or five days. We've never gotten rain like that out here before in uh, Western New York. But for the last four or five days, it's been raining and I've been wearing my boots. So, cause my boots had got dusty cause I hadn't worn them. Let me see if I can show y'all my boots. Y'all see my, y'all see my rain boots? <laughs> them my boots. So the rain and stuff is knocking the dust off of them. <laughs> So guys, I just wanted to come on and say good morning. And um, I will see you guys in the next clip. Child, I guess. Only if it's the Lord's will, child, because I don't know. <laughs> Alright guys, hold on. Hey guys. So I'm back. Um, I was thinking about something, y'all. I was watching um, it's this particular channel that I watch. And... Um, what had happened was the the little one of the kids, the, the lady has children, and one of the little kids had bit the other child, and um, you know everybody was in the comments section because I think she was on live at the time. Yeah, it was live. It wasn't a video. It was live, and um, everybody in the comments section was telling her, you know, she need to whip the little girl's ass, you know, for biting the other little child, and so. You know, this is what everybody kept saying in the comment section. So she came back and did a video to, uh, today because apparently a lot of people was addressing it um, in the comments after the live about her uh, disciplining the, the child. And she was like, you know, I'm not going to um, whip my kids. And she said, well, I don't show everything on camera and I'm not going to whip my kids ass on camera. And I'm, I'm sitting up here saying uh, as well, you shouldn't like you would be a fool to whip your kids ass on live or on Facebook is any kind just period cuz trust me you whip your child's ass on live or on camera and somebody will take that video and go show it to the police and they will they will find your ass okay it's called an IP address okay so you're not gonna get away with that okay so I so um, applaud her for not being a fool trying to please the masses girl I, I i just be wanting to tell people can y'all shut all the way the fuck up because that girl will be a fool to whip the child on camera just to please you and didn't have the uh protective services uh knocking at her door trying to take her children away no honey so yeah y'all stop that foolishness it's just because somebody doesn't discipline their child physically on camera doesn't mean that they don't discipline their child you know, everything is not shown, you know, as well as it should be. Um, you know, if that's what she chooses. But that beating a child on camera, definitely not. <laughs> I said, don't people touch. I said, the main ones that sitting on there telling her to discipline her child, as soon as she beat that child on camera, they be the main ones calling the people. Girl, bye. 
I was just sitting here thinking about that because I had watched it this morning while I was getting uh, ready, girl. While I was getting it all the way together, girl. I ain't do my my nails last night, girl. I was tired. By the time I got off live last night with y'all, I had went and um, well, I cleaned up, you know, the little mess that I had made. I had folded clothes and um, and then I had to go wash my makeup off. Then I had to twist my hair up, you know, because I got too straight twisted at night so that it could be gorgeous in the morning, girl. And by the time I did all that, girl, I was like, mm -mm, I ain't going to be able to sit there and do no nails. So, and I meant to bring the nails with me um, to this morning because I could have did where we're going at. I could have did them. But that's okay. I'll do them. You know, they'll get done. Girl, bye. Hold on, girl. Child, mm, don't beat your kids on camera, girl. Tell them people shut all the way the fuck up. Damn it. Hey guys, still in the car, but I had another thought. See, I be riding and thinking and stuff. So, yesterday on the Steve Harvey morning show, I'm sorry. There is no morning show, sir. Anyway, it's the whole song going. What morning show? They stopped talking now, but uh, right, they started talking as soon as I started this. Yeah, but you Mind your right. business. Anyway, um, so on the Steve Harvey morning show yesterday, somebody had pranked their girlfriend. Their girlfriend is so sanctified. Y'all know them Holy Ghost sanctified Bible thumping, you know, people, right? Um, <laughs> and I, you know, ain't, ain't no shade, you know. I mean, well, it is shade, shade but no shade, okay? No tea, no shade. But anyway, like I said, um, so. The, the lady had pranked, you know, they do the pranks on Steve Harvey Morning Show. So the man had called called her and was telling her that the church members was complaining because, you know, she'd be, I guess, getting the Holy Spirit a lot in the church and be jumping around and hollering and stuff. So the people was complaining that they couldn't hear the service because of her, you know, her outburst of being in the spirit or, or whatever have you. And um, so they were saying something about if she don't stop um, all of that hollering and dancing and carrying on in the church, they was going to put her out of the church. And she was steady on there saying, Jesus, Lord Jesus. And then that girl, it got to the point, I think when he said something about putting out the church, child, when that woman started cussing, honey, I hollered. Because, you know, see, that's what I'm saying about them church folks. And I look, if you get offended, girl, by, I, look, I, I'm just speaking, telling the truth and shaming the devil, okay? This has been what I have experienced, what I've seen from a lot of the so-called Christian people, okay? They sanctified and Holy Ghost filled, girl, until you make them mad, okay? Make them mad, girl, and they'll cuss just like the average sinner out there in the street, okay? But let you cuss, just in general. Let you be cussing. Oh, Lord, child, these people just cussing. Lord, bless them. Lord, forgive them. Lord, they need to, to get saved. But then when they get mad, girl, they will cuss you out. What, what is up with that? With the Christians? Child. Mm, 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 I can't. That's why I don't do Christianity. I don't do church. Girl, I do spirituality. Spirituality. Okay? I don't I do not do all that. That foolishness. Because them people is hypocrites, child. They will cuss you in a minute. In a hot minute. Alright, girl. Let me go. Because we just arrived at where we go with it. But I just thought I, I'd say that. <laughs> girl, bye. Hold on. I'm sinking in the rain. I'm sinking in the rain. <laughs> Girl, I love the rain, y'all. Girl. Ah, oh, boy. So, get ready to go in this place, girl. And I will talk to you guys in a little bit. Wait a minute. Hold on, y'all. Down here, child. We got this um, hospital girl. Oh, okay. So I just wanted to vlog with you guys today. Yeah, my husband is having surgery today. So that's where we are, girl at this uh, well it's not a hospital i guess it's like a facility and they do surgeries it's nice in here though very nice 
Yes, I haven't did a vlog style video in a while. So today is November the 1st, child. I can't believe it. How the month of October just flared. Now we're in November. Next, um... 364. Oh, wait a minute. Hold on, y'all. Hey, guys. So, I was just looking at this post on his Facebook. <laughs> the lady said... I just need a husband that understands that I just need to be alone. I was like, what? <laughs> if you just want to be alone, then you don't need no husband. So I don't know if she want a husband, but she want to be alone, but then he's there for the benefit. Like, I don't I don't get it. So I looked at her status. It's just separated. So I said, well, I guess her, her husband understood that she needed to be alone, so he left. <laughs> <laughs> so listen guys I was just sitting here reading because reading is fundamental girl I don't just read people girl I read but anyway it said what you mean oh. <laughs> it said 10 tips to live a longer healthier life <laughs> so remember yesterday y'all I was telling y'all about you know how when you get like 50 and 60 and people you know, the naysayers and the haters want to say, girl, you need to sit your old ass down. Uh-uh. Girl, it's been confirmed, girl. It says, move it or lose it. It says, sedentary behavior increases the risk of both chronic disease and death. Now, sedentary behavior means just sitting your ass down. <laughs> you're not dancing, you're not moving, you just sit now. It says, um, regular activity and exercise has many benefits, including better strength and better mood. Many chronic diseases like diabetes, high blood pressure, and heart disease, to name a few, can be controlled by exercising. What kind and how much? That could easily be the topic of several other articles, but you can learn more at www.health.gov PA guidelines slash guidelines. Anyway, one study looked at people who were in their 60s and did not have chronic disease when the study started. Eight years later, those who became active were three times as likely to avoid chronic disease, functional decline, and depression as those who remained inactive. And even studies on much older and more frail people have shown that exercise improves health and function. Okay. <laughs> so, don't let nobody tell you sit your old ass down. Mm. They tell you, sit, tell them to tell your mama to sit her old ass down. <laughs> oh, girl, it's raining. It's still raining, y'all. All right, girl. I'll be back. Go back. Hold on. Oh, I ain't tell y'all the other things. It's 10 tips to live a longer, healthier life. And I'm not going to read everything under each one of them. Okay, so the first one is move it or lose it. Eat more vegetables. Nurture your relationships. Don't smoke. Sleep well. Manage stress. Keep learning. Maintain a healthy weight. Embrace change and see your primary care provider regularly. Oh, okay. So that's 10 tips to live a longer, healthier life from As Right Now, girl. That is the helpful tip of this week on November the 1st, girl. Oh, that's a lot of noise. That was my boots, y'all. My ear ring, What? I want your boots. I can't lean on my lips, Oh, sorry. That's right, it hurts. What? Say good morning to the people. Oh, say good morning to them. Say it again. Can you turn it around? <laughs> I'm gawking. 
<laughs> yeah, y'all, he got issues with his left shoulder. So, yeah. All right, oh, my earring came off, girl. All right, girl, bye. I got to go. Hold on. Hey, guys. So, I'm still here. They just took my husband back to get him prepped for surgery, and then, um, they're gonna call me back so I can see him before he goes in. So I just wanted to let you guys know that I'm still here, child. I'm, I'm sleepy. It keeps getting dark. So I'm sleepy and I'm hungry. Mm -mm -mm. Why I keep getting dark? Yeah, so, girl, I don't have nothing to talk about. I just came over here to say that they just took him back for prepping purposes. And, um, you know. So, I guess I'll come back to y'all on that clip, child. I'm slippy. <laughs> Hold on, y'all. Still raining. Well, let's see. Well, it's not raining no more, but it's dreary. It's supposed to rain today, tomorrow, and Saturday and Monday. Girl, we just been getting rain, rain, rain. So if you're a person that collects rainwater, yeah. You should have a ton by now out here. <laughs> Alright, hold on. <laughs> Hmm? Oh, okay. So we back here, guys. It's about to go into surgery, so. Mm -hmm. Hold on, guys. So, guys, I think I'm going to end the vlog here. Um, just sitting here waiting for them to take my husband back into surgery. And, and then that's how my day is going. So. Yeah, he's sleepy medicine they gave him is for numbing is for it's like pain it's numbing and pain medicine so that after surgery you know he won't be in pain right after surgery but it makes you sleepy that's what the, the nurse was telling me so yeah, sure. you can hear him snoring Boo. Mm -hmm. <laughs> you in the hospital snoring? <laughs> you snoring, boo. Mm -hmm. <laughs> yeah, the, the medicine they gave you was for pain. It's a numb medicine and pain medicine so that when you come out of surgery, you know, you won't be hurting. And they said that'll last like probably 12 hours after surgery. So that you won't be hurting. No, I know. Hmm? You want to eat? <laughs> he said he want to eat. <laughs> he couldn't eat after midnight last night. So and the only thing he could do this morning was drink a little bit of water. So he's very hungry. 
And so am I, girl, because I didn't eat before I left the house this morning, so I'm hungry, too. <laughs> Wait a minute, I can't hear you. Oh, sorry. What you say, bro? That's what we do. That's what we do. That's what? That's what we do. What, what, what you talking about? You talking about that's what we do. That's why we married. What we do, bro? We what? What? We eat. <laughs> he talk crazy. So what you want to eat after um you know when we leave here? It's outpatient, y'all, so he'll be coming home today. Oh, you ain't that sleepy. Fried fish. From where? Hmm? Okay. What chicken? I thought you said you wanted for, oh, you talking about for dinner. Oh, is he? He ain't frying no chicken. I'm at the fried chicken. Yes, I'm at the cook, y'all. Can y'all believe it? I am going to have to cook because my husband is not going to be able to uh, uh, do the, the do. So I have all the duties now, the, the, the house cleaning and the um, the cooking. So he said he want me to fry some chicken tonight. Frying chicken and stuff. So. You want to say anything to the people, Bo? You want to say anything to the people on YouTube? What you want to say? Wait, I'm going to turn the camera around on you. What you going to say, Bo? Don't get hurt at work. Don't get hurt at work. <laughs> he said don't get hurt at work. <laughs> yeah, he got hurt at work. That's why he got his surgery, y'all. All right, say bye to the people, Bo. <laughs> said, keep y'all in his prayers. No, he said, keep him in your prayers. <laughs> You're going to be fine. So, um, not a long surgery. And it's outpatient, so that's a good thing. It's not a surgery where you get surgery and you got to stay in the hospital for a couple of days. It's outpatient, so. But all surgeries have, you know, dangers and effects, so. It's going to be just fine. It's going to be a nurse coming to the house to help him with um, therapy, you know, right after surgery. So, it's going to be a good thing, huh? Boy, hush. she wants to say bro what else she wants to say what else she want to say because somebody bring you something to eat <laughs> no you can't have nothing to eat <laughs> what When? Boy, hush. I hope y'all ain't hear him. He's talking crazy. Real crazy. <laughs> so, guys, I'm going to get off of here. Um, I think I'll maybe go grab a bite to eat while he's, you know, um, doing this. And, um, here, yeah, grab a bite to eat, occupy my time and my mind while this is happening. So, 
I will talk to you guys on the next video. Make sure you subscribe and make sure you share a girl. Share a girl. Share a girl. Girl, bye. <laughs>